what's up everybody Naresh here welcoming you back into another video where today I have got my hands on this all new echo flex a complete all new plug-in smart speaker plus Alexa by Amazon now in my personal opinion this little device is fantastic if you are into home automation the reason is I have got couple of echo dots and I wanted to install more around the house but to do that I have to buy an echo dot along with a holder to hold it so this is the kind of setup i have at this moment of time as you can see that echo dot itself is very bulky so is this charger too now i can get rid of the whole thing with this all new echo flex but there are some compromises starting with the size of the speaker which we have an echo flex is way smaller than echo dot so the sound quality will be compromised but my main purpose is home automation and a little speaker to tell me yes okay and all good simple is that and when I ask up weather it just give me a weather notification not a great sound I can still connect this echo flex with the Bluetooth speaker as well as on auxiliary port to another speaker if I want to well I suppose I gave you enough information and my call for buying this echo flex now let's have a look what comes with this echo flex and its features and after that we're going to connect it with our Amazon Alexa app and show you how it's going to work a little bit of performance is always better to know about the system you are getting into so let's quickly have a look into the features of this echo flex which are starting with the USB a port so you can charge your mobile phone or you can have a night light as well one 3.5 mm audio output if you'd like to connect a blue uh, non bluetooth supporting devices just to play them as a speaker you can also have a bluetooth connectivity as well as a far field voice control microphones as well as a manual microphone mute on and off button now let's check out what is included in the package So here we have everything which come with the echo flex starting with the user manual explaining to you what to do and what things are in it and the leaflet for regulation and last but not least echo flex which is pretty much straight and a simple design and to be honest with you is going to suit all the decor of your house as well where to start with on echo flex you have a power plug and in the front far field microphones in the middle a status indicator light which is Alexa blue standard action and a mute button in the front as well as a little speaker down below as I mentioned in the features it also come with the USB a port which is capable to deliver 7 watt of output kind of okay for charging your mobile phone or plugging in a third party night lights or PER sensor I will leave a link for them in the video description if you would like to check them out echo flex also come with the 3.5 mm auxiliary output if you would like to connect this echo flex with your non bluetooth supporting devices or your home entertainment system now think about it if i'm going for home automation where i've got to select this part which is very expensive but with the bigger speaker and a flex which is going to do the same job for the home automation but with a little speaker i'm kind of okay with this thing well let's go ahead and power up echo flex first time and open up alexa app app can also be installed from google play store as well as from apple store hello your device is ready for setup just download the alexa app and follow the instructions hello dein gerät kann jetzt eingerichtet werden descarga la app alexa y sigue las instrucciones bringing your device online just a moment if you already have amazon alexa app fully configured on your mobile phone and working in your home network you don't need to do anything your echo flex will be already in your available devices if you click on to the all devices here you should be able to locate your echo flex which is already connected now if you'd like to reconnect it it's very easy and straightforward as well but press and hold this action button for a little longer you're going to see this in status indicator light changing to orange color once you've done it you need to add the device as simple as that now this flex is up and running straight away out of the box with your alexa application let's test it out alexa how's weather in Huddersfield 
It's 1 degree Celsius with mostly cloudy skies. Tonight's forecast calls for more of the same with a low of 1 degree. Now let's quickly compare the speaker sound which is coming out of this Echo Flex with third generation Echo Dot. Alexa, how's weather? In Golkar, it's 1 degree Celsius with mostly cloudy skies. Tonight's forecast calls for more of the same with a low of zero degrees. While we can definitely see the difference in sound quality which is coming out of Echo Dot as well as in Flex. But that is really we should not be comparing these two products at. It's all about the Alexa functionality and what they offer. In terms of that way they both offer the same thing and they are fantastic in their own market range. Now in my opinion Amazon have put a lot of effort into the Echo Flex design and they really created a great product come with the USB output of 7.5 watt which is enough to charge your mobile phone too. It will not be a fast charge but something is better than nothing when your power socket is used as well. Now here I have a very typical example that with the help of Echo Flex you can make a non Bluetooth supporting device which could be a typical your old home theater system to have a wireless connectivity of Bluetooth. So what you exactly do is very simple connect your Echo Flex using the 3.5 mm auxiliary cable to your non Bluetooth supporting device then connect your mobile phone which is Bluetooth supporting with your Echo Flex which is very easy to do so by using the Amazon Alexa app. Now let me quickly show you how you're going to do that by going into your Amazon Alexa app and click on to the all devices where you're going to locate your Echo Flex open it up and go down into the Bluetooth settings. Now in here click on to the pair new device. Now your Echo Flex is in appearing mode. It will look for all the devices you find around your network. Now while it's searching you need to make sure the Bluetooth device you wanted to connect with your Echo Flex is in pairing mode kind of thing or in discovery mode actually. Now if you go into the Bluetooth setting right in here open it up you should be able to locate Echo Flex CAC click on it. Connected to Huawei P30 Pro. There you go. Now that you're paired next time just say connect my phone. So there we go now you are connected you can play music straight from your mobile phone onto your non bluetooth supporting devices or home theater if you want to by using this echo flex. I'm sorry guys I cannot I'm sorry guys I cannot increase the volume because kids are sleeping in next room. But I suppose now you have got an idea that how you can use this Echo Flex very nicely around your house. Now this is very obvious to say that this Echo Flex is offered by Amazon and they time to time offer a lot of great deals. So keep an eye on comment section down below and within the video description I have placed a link for this product. So whenever an offer will be available you can straight away go in there and purchase one if you want to. Well the current price at the moment for this Amazon Flex is about $24.99 in UK it's about $35 in US I suppose. I'm sure they will come down as well. If they do so why not grab them then guys. Well now let's end this video right in here by me saying to you if you like this video why not hit the like button and subscribe for more as well. I'll be keep bringing you good stuff which is offered by Amazon or any other big brand in the market. If you'd like to see more about these things please let me know in the comment section down below too. See you then guys. Bye for now.